like... Do you know what? No! Well, that hit that switch again. I'm, but that's not the switch that I'm looking for. I want to hit this one! Ah, the one right in front. I don't know how I got that one bomb to stop. That was really weird. I think that was a glitch or something. This one I'm almost positive I have to time correctly with the uh, bomb blast. Ugh! Just like a game of Bomberman, baby. Oh yeah. So let's just wait there. There we go! Ah, oh, I hit a switch accidentally. Well, those switches are easy to hit in back there. It's this front one that I'm worried about right now. Poobars, uh -huh. we can do this. We are PK Gam. Yeah, awesome. And I'm going to get this fourth gem before it disappears. Finally. I wonder if I should cut ahead or something. Well, I'll do so if I have to, like if I'm running low on time and I want to get this into two parts or something like that. So I guess we'll see how the editing goes, or I should, depending on how well I do in this part. Um... I'm gonna throw the key up there for safekeeping, and- Ah! Oh, I did not mean to fall down there! Oh shoot! That was mean! I just landed right back on the bumper. So what's down this way? Uh, wait. Question mark! Question mark! What is this? Blasphemy! I can kill this penguin Zora hybrid- Ah! Oh, or he can kill me. That works for him. Um, what is the point of this area? I do not know. But why do I need to unlock the area? And there's a force fairy. Whoops. I would really like that force fairy, actually. Um, can I, like, hit that question mark thing with fire? No, it fails. And the force fairy is going to disappear. No. Come back. Oh, well. So what's over here? I'm about... I'm, I've yet to even see what that, what that locked door is. Uh, holy cow, what, how many paths are there around here? Like, that locked door seems like something that I would, you know, have to do to go forward, so... Uh, but at the same time, the other path seems like it's, like, a whole different path. What, whoa, what the heck? What is with these question marks? Well, this is definitely something that I'm gonna have to learn about when I get to it. Ah! There, I probably need, like, to jump on him or something like that, because that seems like the jumping range. It's, it's just a guess. I don't know. I don't remember those question marks at all. So let's go back to here. Burn our way through this nasty, icy prison. So we, ah, shoot. I do not mean to lose force gems. Oh, poopers. I'm just getting hit all over the place. And now let's just, let's just burn all these things first. Uh, just to clear our way. Like so. Yeah. Oh, poopers. Stop that. Can I, like, burn both of them with one shot? No, for some reason. Even though you would think the radiating heat would uh, burn them just like we could do those snow banks in the last part. But alas, that is not the case. It looks like all these blocks can be pushed over, like, onto the darker spaces. At least it seems like it. I don't know. Um, man, what do, I, what do I need to do over here, really? There's just, like, so many switches and blocks... I guess I gotta start with something. Like, let's like, let's just press a switch, or let, let's press some switches. Like, let's just do that, and let's just press the individual switches first. Or, wait, 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 wait. What if, what if I, like, what if I push this down like this, and... Can I, like, push those, um, blocks over by the, or I should say on top of the switches? Because that would make a lot of sense. Like, if I did this... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I see. It's it's like one of those kinds of puzzles that you push blocks aside um, to stop other blocks from moving. Kind of like one of those things. What if I push like this one down here? Switch to ready over here. Yes, I call them ready. Wait, can't I push? There we go. Um, blue, blue dude. Okay, that that presses that. Green, you can press this switch, like that, and Toucan Sam Purple can press this. Yeah, I know Toucan Sam isn't purple at all, I'm just being weird here because I'm thinking of the puzzle. And all eight switches are pressed, what does this do? A single treasure chest pops out of nowhere, and this will give me 200 force gems? What? Was that seriously all that room had to offer? 
Okay, so what is the point of those question mark squares? Like, I can't throw a link across there. Just like, just saying that right now. So, that's, maybe that's the exit for like this room up here. So let's try and throw a link into the question mark, okay? Let's just grab you and throw you right into the question mark. No, that failed. So I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Um, can I burn these suckers? No. And I didn't see any other items along the way other than the fire rod, did you? I don't think I did. What am I asking you for? You won't see this video until it's all the way and ready up. I'm just acting weird, as I said before. Um, oh shoot, all these ice blocks came back. Well, I already got the prize that was in this room anyway, so I guess I will need to burn them all over again to solve this puzzle. And they're really... Oh, wait, what the heck? How did I miss this? Ah, poopers. Okay, so that question mark will probably be revealed right now when I open this treasure chest. Or not. I've got 2,000 force gems. 2,130, I should say. Um, so, I don't know why I'm even saying that because my sword is already powered up, but whatever. I'm just uh, thinking way too hard. And wait, can I power up this rod with a fairy? I hear the music. It can now make blocks and floating... Is that what the question mark platforms are say? Are, is that what the question marks are for? For making platforms? That sure would make a lot of sense. So, let's see... What does this do? Oh, what? Can I, like, throw this? Yes, I can! Awesome! Okay, what if, if I press that switch, it moves it, okay. So... That works like that. Okay, so that makes a lot of sense. So I can make my own platforms. Let's do that, and do that! Yay! Does this go to the middle? And there's a lot of things here. So let's just take it one step at a time. And I wonder what triggers um, the platforms to move in one direction or the other. Or maybe they just do it automatically. I don't know, but I want this one to move down. And it moved down, thank you. Um, can I like burn this too? Wait, but that's not what I'm looking for. I want fire rod goodness. Can I like, oh, okay. So if I like do this and then I like did something like this, like put a block there and then, yeah, that, that does start them on fire, but I bet you they have to start on fire at the same time. Oh, that worked. Oh, awesome. So, let's get some heart containers, I guess. That, there's like a lot of heart containers in this one. I got three already. And throw this here. There we go. I want this to go... I was going to say I want it to go down, but... Oh, well. So, this leads us to the other question mark thingy. Um, so, do I want to go this way? Probably. I can throw links across that gap there. There's a switch there. Um, I'll probably need two links on the other side. So let's just throw two of you critters right across here, like that. And like that. Ah, oh, poopers! Did not mean to do that. Do not clash your links, people. And put Greeny up here. And now let's see what's over here. Probably more switches. There's one switch. There's the other switch. Okay. So, now I need two cans, Sam. And there we go. There's a treasure chest. Two of them, actually. Four of them. Whoa! What is all of this blasphemy? I don't know, but I am about to find out. Uh, 200 of them right there, too. And another heart container. That's eight hearts. Wow. So this will allow me to go to that um, middle area just by like sliding it across like so. Yeah. And open says me. And what's in here? Um, I can know I can burn those by doing that. Can I like? Yeah, I can walk, walk across there. For some for some reason, upon quick glance, I thought that was water. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't burn all those blocks. 
Because I've kept that invasion away from me, jeez. Yeah, that'll make things a whole lot easier. So only burn one set of blocks at a time, I guess. I should say burn only one side of the blocks at a time. Ah, don't do that. Please, don't do that. Okay. Um, let's just kill all these guys, and the pathway to the heaven should be revealed. Um, I don't know why I said heavens anyway, I'm just, as I said before, acting weird for the fun, but force gems! I do not need more of them, but you could always have more of them in case you want to get some more force fairies, which I would like, because I'm starting to, uh, you know, run a little bit low. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I've still got like over 50 force fairies roaming around here. So there's a room full of burnable things, and I like burnable things. Like you guys! Yeah! People are very burnable, which is why you should always start them on fire every time you see them. Or at least in Zelda games. Um, there's some switches there. I can burn this stuff like so. Uh, there's pots hidden inside this. Uh, oh, the Force Fairy! Yay! I guess you can't tell what's inside any of these ice sculptures until you open one up. So, what looks like some sort of enemy is actually... could be anything. Um... Boink! And where did all that fire come from? I do not know! Uh, oh, I see what I need to do. I need to, like... Um... Explode all them. Like that. Yeah, I get it. Like that, and then go into vertical formation. Uh, yeah, there we go. Ooh, feather. Is this something that I want? Something tells me it is. So let's leave my level 2 fire rod behind. I can o I was gonna say I, I could always go back to get it, but I guess I can't. Oh my god, you guys are very aggressive. So I'm gonna jump and press the B button to slam down on your head like so. And that hurt a little bit, but you took far more damage than I did. And, oh, poopers. I'm just going to jump across. Yeah. Yeah, oh, poopers. One more time! Ugh. Oh, shockwave. Come on, baby. You're done! Woo! Well, you aren't that hard at all, now, are you? So let's go up here. Did I want to take my fire rod? I don't know, but I'm now outside. Is this a secret sanctuary? It is sacred grounds? Oh, my goodness, let's proceed! There appears to be some sort of ritual coming. I'm kind of scared, but I'm going to go for it anyway. All the main. Oh, wait, this is where we started from. This is where the uh, Four Sword rested. Yep, Four Sword Sanctuary. How the poop did I end up all the way. I mean, you know, when I when the game started, I started here, but then I, you know, I kind of like transported way, way off to the plains to the east of here. So that's way far off. So the jewels go on those pillars. Hear me, heavens, hear me, earth. You the light of the world, jewels, and shine here and restore to us the Toe of Winds! Yes, that was a very deep, manly voice for those uh, maidens at first there, but but they, they, they got back to their uh, normal voice in just a sec. Ooh, glowy. Pretty. It's all greenish now. It's like everything has been restored. Awesome! Barriers! Ah, you are the bane of my time consumption. And there we go. Give me force fairies. Oh, I'm gonna be one, I should say, like, one, about 100 short of uh, getting three force fairies. Ah, oh, what a ripoff. Well, it was more like 40 some short. Well, whatever. That's the end of this part. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part. Toodaloo!